Hi everybody! And welcome back to more Daggerfall with me, John Zeitberg1417, and with Gallant. There he is. And we are currently residing at the Feather and the Priest Inn here at Sentinel City. And a lot of things happened last time. Um, wait a second, just let me get to the menu here. No, we need to get out of that for that. And please bear with me, I haven't played in like three weeks or so, so I may be a bit rusty. Uh, but nothing a quick recap can't remedy. As I said, a lot of things happened last time. We did find the last words of Prince Kelpim and returned them to Prince Lutun at Castle Sentinel, uh, who in fact provided us with some information about the whole Lysandus situation. Because as it appears, during the time of the war between Sentinel right here and Daggerfall right here, um, King Lysandus had an affair with a sorceress named Medora Dereni, which of course angered Queen Minisera, his wife, who is now the uh, residing at Castle Daggerfall still, but not as the queen, because the current queen is Aup Ki, who is the sister of Prince Lutun from Sentinel, which was um, a way to ensure peace between the two, well, nations or regions. Medora Dereni herself has been banished to the Isle of Belfiera, where she's in a tower which supposedly she can't leave. And one of those people may know more about why King Lysandus is haunting the streets of Daggerfall City. Now, I don't think Gallant wants to go to the court of Daggerfall to investigate further. Because it's doubtful that Queen Minisera would like to talk about her late husband's affair, so it's probably a better idea to start directly at the Isle of Balfiera and look for Medora Dereni. And I, as a player, I think that's way more probable place to start because we actually got directions to it, so it's kind of nudged us in this direction. And. I did mention last session that it's going to take a long while to actually search the whole island for her, but I now know, because I've been naughty and looked at the wiki, because I, c I couldn't just think that's possible that, that you have to search the whole island, that um, we actually just have to type in Dereni Tower, which makes sense, so that should be possible. But before that, Galland is way in over his head here, and, and his quest has is, is just now gotten room starting, he's gonna start it so to speak, and because of that he needs spiritual guidance. And Stendar, him being a merciful, peaceful god, doesn't just doesn't cut it anymore for him. So instead he's going to pledge allegiance to Ebonarm, which isn't directly possible because he doesn't have temples, but it has been said, thanks to the user called Mr. Knight, that in the Alakir Desert most fighters guild are actually mosques dedicated to Avanarm. So we're going to go there. Look for a major city in the Alakir Desert and... Um... Yeah. Look for stuff there. We try to pledge allegiance to those fighters guilds, do a quest for them, and then be all spiritually charged and everything. And... I apologize for getting Laura of Ebonarm wrong last time I talked about him, or last couple of times I talked about him. I've gotten him mixed up with somebody else. Ebonarm doesn't have Nord Origins, that was somebody else. Ebonarm, well, he's basically the, the purest fighter god you can imagine, what with a sword for an arm, and he's uh, enemies with a lot of people. He's Ebon uh, enemies, for example, with the Daedric Princess, which would please Gallant. He's enemies with mages, he's also, which might make things complicated, enemies with, enemies with the Temple of Stender, so maybe we won't even be able to join a fighter skill here, but we're going to try. Um, he has been a bit disappointed by Stendar. So this is kind of a, a reasonable move for him. But yeah, that's what we're going to do. And... 
What's that? Oh, that's also the Alicru Desert. Alright, never mind. Uh, we don't know where exactly we need to go. I think we're simply... No? Uh, we're simply st going to start north somewhere in something that looks like a st uh, city. Gentle Star of Stendar. Let's actually start there. That's a coincidence. I didn't know that was there. Yeah, let's start there and then see if we can find a Temple of Stendar because we could train restoration there. That would come in handy. Yeah. Uh, recklessly. And we don't need a ship. Okay, apparently we do. Uh, yeah. Let's get going then. Ah. <sighs> Does look deserty. Considering that the names and everything are generated randomly, there may not even be a temple of Stendar in the Gentle Star of Stendar. But <laughs> yeah. Although that does look like a temple. Also, I think yeah, it is a temple. It may be a way to appease the temple that he's before he's aligning himself with with Evan Arm. Although it's only said that Evan Arm has a problem with Stendar, not that Stendar has a problem with Evan Arm, but it's not necessarily the same thing. Hello! Uh, regional? That's... Although we could ask about a fighter's guild right here. You tell me. I honestly... Okay, they're playing hard to get. Uh... Hello. No, I don't want the quest. Training. Yes, we do have enough money. Hmm. Restoration. Okay. Okay. We can't train anymore, can we? No. But it's a start, I guess. Uh do anything. Can't we make potions or buy potions somewhere here? Because that might come in handy. Make potions. Oh, high ranking members. Buy potions. Oh, we are not in risen enough in rank. We're not taking the money that's lying around here, although, yeah, it's not the first time that we find that in the temple. Heathens! Right here in the temple. Uh, books. On Oblivion, that book's in Morrowind as well. Uh, continue. I wonder if it's the same one. I don't remember what it said exactly in Morrowind. It's been a while, but that would be kind of neat. Yeah. Uh, and maybe an inn in here. That's a small place. Nobody's out. We may simply have to travel to a different town if we don't find anything here. We just need somebody to talk to, really, who who can tell us if there's a fighter's guild nearby. I'm guessing there won't be one in here, in this town. Um, since the Alaka Desert apparently has fighter's guild who are not necessarily aligned with Stendhal, but rather Evan Arm. That a, was that a sign for, for, for this building, or was that just a random sign? Hmm. Who knows, who knows? Nah. Don't wanna go breaking into houses. I guess we're simply going to travel to a different city then. This one certainly doesn't have a fighter's guild in it. Oh, but the manor. It's hard to judge from the names if something is a... Alicra. That may be the capital or something. Just judging from the name. And I I, uh, I get the feeling that uh, this, is, this region is far, far more sparsely settled than the other ones. This, 
far less stuff in here, so to speak. And the region itself is far more spacious. But yeah, let's let's just go here. Alikra, why not? Okay. Did the game just bug out on me? Apparently it did. Yeah, can't do anything. Alright, I'll see you in the next video. That should be easily fixed. It's not like I did a lot of things. See you then.